day three underway. Got a big day in front of us, 10.30. Let's go. Oh, thank you. I needed to let everybody know about what was gonna be happening out here. You guys get a negative electric bill, it would have said credit balance. Okay, that's why I'm here. So what's gonna happen is the $200 bill that you might have today will eventually go up to three, 400 with the upgrade with the infrastructure. Oh. So by having it produced on site, you're not at the mercy of the power company. This isn't like a doorstep decision. Is she gonna be up later on? I'm super busy today. If you talk to her and she's like, we never wanna do this, just tell me no, I'm not gonna okay, bother yeah. you. But don't ghost me, that's the only thing that I don't like. You know, I'll text you and then just give me a yes or no. Sounds Sound good? good? Thank you, take care. Take it as far as you can. Hi, how are you? The utility company was just fined $1.7 million. Do you kind of know why? No, but I'm, I'm not really interested in anything. Oh no, there's nothing to be interested in. You guys get a do not pay or credit balance on the last bill? Uh, no, I don't, I don't remember. Okay, don't remember. the power company. Is this like a bad time for you? Yeah, I don't, I don't want to do this. Okay. Do what? Talk about it. Okay, I can try to come back in like an hour if that's better. Uh, I'm just not interested. Oh no, there's no way you could be. I didn't explain it. Uh, you weren't thinking about canceling the Encore account, right? No, I'm, I'm just not interested. Thank you. Okay, I'll try to come back like Monday if that's better. No, it's not. Okay, Tuesday? Yeah, so. No, no, no. God bless. God bless. Take care. Thanks for your service, by the way. So are you just going to introduce yourself? I'll be here to help you. Make sure that you tell a story, and then after you tell the story, you want to create a pain. This, or hey, we've had a ton of inquiries because people have been sick and tired of getting nickel and dime. You might have noticed the solar happening in the neighborhood. Hi, sir, how are you? This is Erin, it's her first day. Hi, Aaron, how are you doing? She's going to let you know what's going on. So it's her first day today. What's going on, Erin? Okay, so thank you for talking to me. So I'm in the area just talking to people about their electric bills. You're the first customer I've okay. ever talk to you at the door. <laughs> Just to show you, you get optimal sun. What you would do is take the money that you would have given to the utility company and shift it into true ownership where you take the tax credit. I can either text you, say, hey, I have the report completed. Do you want me to drop it off one day next week? Yeah. I don't Right. Yeah, we're on our way. Sorry about that. That's okay. I need yeah. right. Happy wife, happy life. Do you want me to leave you with this, with my number? Do a time yep. Your time. Take care. All right, good job. So all you got to do is you got to practice, get it comfortable, you know? Um, I'm just following up with some of the homeowners over here. I would look into if you were overcharged for the power if your bill is 250. 250 is almost off of our charts. 250 is maybe like a home with like four kids that are playing Xbox all night or watching YouTube or playing Fortnite. You know, I really think we're not going to be interested. I have never had someone knock on my door and had it be worth my while. Okay. You know, if I'm predisposed not to be open to something that just suddenly hits me like this. Did it all kind of make sense though, what, he's, what he explained? Yeah, it, of course it, uh, he wouldn't say it if it didn't make sense. Well, I mean, but, to you though, it, made, it kind of made sense, yeah. but it's just because you've had a bad experience. I think there's a right way and a wrong way to power a home. You own your Mini Cooper, you don't lease it, but you lease your power. You rent your power, the utility company's a landlord. Don't be speeding too much with this Mini Cooper. I know they're like little go-karts, you know? You have a good day. Hey, God bless, see ya. All right, great presentation, unqualified buyer. Nothing you could have done better. You had a really good pace, you had good rhythm when you were going through it. Just some people are just uh, unqualified. I'm Taylor, I was the one that put together the design and everything for you. For the solar, you told me to pop by at 12 today. Is it okay if I sit real yeah, quick, just yeah, so I can yeah. kind of show you this? How much is it gonna cost me? I mean, literally, how much? Brass tax, my dad yeah. calls it. All right, ready? Yeah, the brass tax. So, the, the new system, your monthly amount would be $51.19. Three years. Well, and, and I realize that yes, in three years, I'm gonna see that thing jump. And at that point, I might be thinking, okay, now it's time to do it. I'll probably wait till it gets to, okay, it's constantly a terrible bill. Um, you know, because. Let's hop in the car. For me, so I can show you the design and everything? Uh, not really. That's what do you have 15, 20 seconds for me? So I can show it to you real if, quick? If that's it. But that's all it is. Let's you put the completely south facing. Give you the ability to have true ownership of the system. I can just set up a time when you have the time. I'd set it up for 10, 15 tomorrow morning. Did you show it to him? I have it right here. Show you what your electric bill looks like. Give me I want my electric bill to be zero. 
What if it's negative thirty dollars? Is that better than zero? That's all. I don't have to pay nothing. I haven't picked your home yet. Look, but you need to tell me what you want to do because that way I can decide if not. Taking the money that you're giving to the utility company, mm -hmm. shifting it into us paying for a system on the home. In return, we ask to use you as a reference point out here. Keep in mind, I can't say yes today, you can't say yes today. Could be about a 60 day process before the panels are actually working on the house for you. One thing I'm going to be very blunt about is when we send the surveyor out here, if he doesn't think that the roof is structurally sound, we may have to disqualify the home. So just before we get too far ahead of ourselves, $131.55 would be the only thing you would be responsible for. This 131, that's 131 a month? 131.55, correct. It won't work. But it's 120% of your power. So I got my electric bill. All right, thank you very much. We'll see you guys So, later. So what part of it didn't make sense? That I don't, that I have to pay $131 every month. So you're, what do you think is going to happen in three years with the 135 with well, the $19 billion right now, infrastructure? I don't care about three years from now. Right now, after September, I only pay $90, $80, $90. Well, your true average is already 135 I got solar panels on my roof making electricity. So I should be able to make enough electricity off those panel panels to where I'm not paying nothing. Yes, this all goes away. That's what I'm trying to explain to you. So You're not paying two bills. Solar systems produces electricity. They're making money for somebody. They're making money. And for if you. I got, if I got things, then they should be making me. Yes, I said that five it, times. They should be making me $300 a month. Why isn't it making me $300 a month? Are you like trying to justify a way to pay more for your power? This panels were set up and I said, hey, I work for Encore. Let's rip off the panels. I'll put you into this situation, but we can raise it at any time. If everything I'm telling you is on that piece of paper, would you lean towards the left or the right? So, what, what, what do you think is the main reason? The main reason I'm going inside. Thank you very much. Off to the next one, boys. He just didn't want to get sold. He knew I was right. Hi, how are you? Oh, your husband's home right now. Just to warn you, though, he's yeah. not enthusiastic about it. So. That's fine. Uh, hi, how are you? I need a roof as it is, so I don't want nothing up there in my way. So if they're gonna put a roof up there, fine. You put solar panels up there. So if I could show you a way that we would put a brand new roof on and then put the solar on, would that be something you'd be open to? It would have to be that. You looked at the utility bill yesterday, right, Ryan? Yeah. Okay, so he's got all your usage. Me, you told me his average bill was 256. That's the last one, so we gotta adjust the. Uh, so what's his average monthly payment? Uh, this is the, the what he told me was 256 average. So if that's not right, then we've got to fix that. That's why we always have to make sure this is right because of this. This, you know. No matter what company supplier you use, it's renting power forever without you coming out of pocket a penny. So you're not paying for the roof out of pocket, you're not paying for the labor. We are just step one of the process. So imagine that there was already solar panels on the roof that you had a $285 fixed amount. Uncore came and knocked on the door and said, let's rip off the panel, let's rip off the new roof, put the old roof back on, and we're gonna put you up to these $300 bills. What would you say? Thing I'm saying now, like, I can't think about it. <laughs> but I you want to talk to her maybe real quick, or we can walk over to the neighbors? Honestly, I'm not sure I want to do it. Let me do some research. And, okay. Because I'm not ready to pull the trigger on something like that today. This level with with us, how much of like what we laid out there do you actually believe? I know that you're going to do all that. Yeah. What I don't like is, you know, I've got a 25 year bill here. The utility company has you in a never ending loan. Okay. Thank you for your time. Yeah. Yeah. Nice to yeah. you guys. Pleasure. Pleasure. But it can really help you if you really think about it. You know, you end up saying yes to something, you know? Yeah. This isn't the meeting about the meeting. Like, this is the meeting. It's either option A is you just say, I don't want to do it or I don't feel comfortable. Or option two is if you're genuinely open to the idea, we can start the process. For, like, it made sense for him, but it's just common sense isn't that common these days.
I was the one that put together the report and everything. A small corner of a table, I can just kind of put my stuff down. And this is like an ideal location for solar, based on the fact that you guys get sun on the home the entire day. We'll explain to you all the reasons why I feel like it makes sense, but ultimately you guys would either do it or not do it based on your own reasons. Typically is a 2.9% escalator, meaning the amount would never go up more than 2.9%. We exempt you from that. We're gonna go all the way down to the back here and then put some on the south. We've got uh, generator backup, 17 kilowatt whole home protection, like legitimate. You're being proactive instead of reactive. And when does everybody get the generator that except if something bad happens? Uh, just adopt some signature. Oh, no, the the bridge. Good leak. We submitted everything for review. Pleasure to meet you. Dude, good thing you were in there for that one because when it got to those steps and stuff, I would have been lost not knowing your software and stuff. It'll go through. It just You just have to jump over a couple hurdles, you know? Oh, what the hell? Doc sent notification? No way. Two minutes ago. You gotta be kidding me, guys. All right, we're coming back. I got a approval letter notification and Doc sent notification. Okay, so we're good to hear. That's <laughs> my famous question. If we snapped our fingers, the solar was set up on the roof, you had the generator all set up, and you had the fixed amount of the 201, and you heard the doorbell ring, it was Encore and Encore trying to come in, rip the panels off, go back to the generator, and go back to Encore, paying them with the raising rates, what would you guys say? If it's the same rate we could pay for the rest of our life, then yes, now I get out of my phone store. Hey. Yep. hey! What would you say? Choose your caliber. <laughs> <laughs> Absolute pleasure. Great thanks for the time and uh, welcome to Texas for me, you know? <laughs> Take care. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We walked out, we had steps, we're on the board. With time running out, as we just gotta try to find ourselves one solid good look and capitalize on it. Um, hey, I'll cut to the chase. Are you the homeowner here? Yeah. Okay. What we're proposing is no, using... I'm good, man. I'm good. Oh, no, we haven't picked the home. You guys I'm just... Good. No, we are too. It's just your whole front with what? We're good. With whatever you get to, I'm good. I'm good. God bless. Next one. I have to ask, what type of car? I don't see those too often. Pay anything to the electric company. No, I'm okay. Thank you. I'll stay with the utility company no matter what. Because that's what... Really. If it's something you wouldn't look at, I can rip it up. Yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't look at it. Just something you wouldn't even look at. All right, God bless, take care. So my strategy late in the day like this is we just want to try to find that one good look and capitalize on it rather than trying to argue with people. Hi, sir, how are you? Oh, I'm pretty good. We got the whole basketball team with me today. Uh, we were the ones that conducted the aerial imagery of all these homes. $150 bill over time, you'd end up paying the utility company this with inflation. What I do is I show you where the panels would be laid out. I'd set up a time with both of you guys where I could just show you. It's very educational. I'll be honest, but not really interested. Okay, you, you weren't thinking about canceling Encore, right? No, no I'm okay. probably not. Whoever. Biggest thing is just getting you to sit down with me for five minutes so I could show it to you. Yeah, but like I said, I'm really not interested right now. If you guys had the solar on the roof and the back of the house, mm -hmm. and let's say this number was $100 and you knew it would never increase, and I said I work for Encore, would you rip off the panels and go back to the 150? Probably not. Probably not. So it's just the old fashioned in you that. I oh, gotcha. I don't like change. All right, so if I dropped it off, you would rip it up or you would just not even look at it? That's it. You'd read it? Okay, if I popped over next week with the report, would you just give me like three minutes to show it to you? Yeah, I'll take three minutes to show it to you. Okay. And then I'll read it. Yep, there's no way I can hurt your situation. But John, I appreciate your time. Junior engineers will pop by next week just to show it to you. Okay. Yeah, bye. Keep it moving. Swing in the bat, boys. Swing in the bat. There you go, Zach. Big truck. They were talking about it yesterday, actually. They were cooking dinner, and the wife got really mad at the husband because he plays Xbox all day, so their electric bill's so high. Seriously, they, they've been wanting to talk to a kid from Lubbock. To talk to you, seriously. All right. They're sick and tired of the high utility bills. Remember, clarity, repetition, energy, belief, service. You're here to help them. You're here to save them. You seen the, the drones flying around? It's not Russia, it's not China, nothing crazy. Did she get one of these yet? Mm, no. Yeah, I'm, ask oh. her, maybe she has. Okay, have you gotten anything that looks like that? I've got a piggy doorbell. Oh, wow. I should have told Zach to, to ring the piggy right there. We would propose an idea that we would pay for the system 
use your roof as a power plant, all the power that that system produces, you're getting in a much more economical amount. When it turns, you have to give them 15 or 16 cents. When the sunlight hits the roof, it would convert the sunlight to negative 16 cents, negative 32 cents. All I would want to fill out with you, it's not a long drawn out decision. So I don't know if there's like a small corner of a table I can yeah. just put my stuff down and then, hi sir, how are you? I'm Taylor, nice to meet you. And you used to be a real life cowboy? Oh yeah. You went on the horses and everything, huh? Oh, yeah. This is the only state that has its own electric grid. $19 billion is just approved to upgrade the infrastructure. They're taking the 19 billion from us, which means the $160 bill mm -hmm. will eventually become a three, $400 bill for families, which is mm -hmm. the bigger issue. See option A, instead of you paying the fee to get it from here to here to here to here to here to here, mm -hmm. if it's produced on site, I can eliminate all these fees. And that's the reason we've had so many inquiries. I think that they know that they have to get that replaced. Is it worth it to send a surveyor out here? Or is it worth them to tell them that we can't do it? How can you pull up that at gmail.com? Do you do it from your phone? Jimmy Baird. You related to Larry? And I really want to go over every detail of this. And I want you guys to tell me that you want to do it or you don't want to do it. Pros of this is you're getting the main panel upgraded. 50% of your bill you're protecting from these crazy increases that are gonna happen with the electric okay. company. Mm -hmm. You're gonna be paying a little bit more, but five years from now, you, you might be paying a little less. What happened right now is it's called a manual review, which has to wait 24 hours. I wanna go over this with you one more time. Okay. I want you guys to sleep on it. Mm -hmm. So if you guys ever watch YouTube, you gotta follow me. Taylor. McCarthy. Okay. Press that red button. Boom. Subscribe. Now, and you can see all oh about my, my life and travel and see all the people I help and all the trainings I do. All right, so we're just checking out in Texas. What a trip. We are with the beautiful family, Miss Mary and Mr. Jimmy. We're gonna really try to help them out. We're gonna give them a couple days. We're gonna try to get them approved. And uh, it was a pleasure meeting you. Thank you so much for the time, the trust and the confidence. And you guys got a message for everybody, huh? We do. If yeah. you like the video, subscribe. Wow. And like, let's and go. Like. Thank you yeah. so much. Mm -hmm. It's nice to be important, but it's more important to be nice. nice. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you for your hospitality. You. Thank you. Yeah. One last question, Mary. Uh -huh. Who's better than you? Nobody. Oh. <laughs> Some madness. Toe tag, body bag them. Terror like Ben Laden. We just want to make it to September laughing. Sipping and splashing in Palisade mansions. So sick and tired of the little homies crashing. Heart saddened. It's hard to maintain when you still active.